Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to meet my college friend after her wedding. It happened in November and I'm going to catch up with her. This is already Feb now. This is just Feb now, okay? <laughs> so yeah, I'm on the way. We are pretty late. We were supposed to meet for brunch, but we made it for late afternoon. There was so much traffic and the cab driver was not in the mood to work. <laughs> As he was a free spirit, could do nothing about it, so I had to make good use of this time I had in the cab. So I went ahead with my Dazzler nail paint. This is my new favorite white shade. I feel like it looks quite elegant and neat. My friend's been checking up on me and I did share the live location. <laughs> She's been waiting at home ready for about an hour. But finally, I'm almost there as you can see. And that's her. <laughs> so we have this thing where we record each other even before I started vlogging. She got in, we started talking about general things. But first we had to motivate the driver to get us to this spot. Asia's largest pub brings Santorini to Bangalore, located in Hennur and spanning 87,000 square feet. The pub captivates visitors with its Instagram worthy aesthetics. Ia is a huge place but still get a reservation. They are pet friendly and child friendly. Some of these were introduced after the first month. Hi! Hi! What's your name? <laughs> Introducing Ia, Asia's largest pub with a seating capacity of over 1,800 people, is right here in Hennor, Bangalore. With its peaceful ambience and all white and beige boho decor, you'll feel like you just stepped onto the streets of Santorini in Greece. And if you think that the jaw-dropping beautiful interiors are the highlight of this place, wait till you have a bite of their scrumptious food and a sip of their irresistible cocktails. We happened to visit two days before Valentine's Day, so there was Valentine's special. We were searching for the best options available while enjoying this beautiful view. Some clicks, cheers and here you go, Valentine's Day special ready red bows. It was so delicious guys, you must try the bows there. And after a lot of trial and error, we started catching up on all that we missed since November. Do this quite often. I do miss her when she's away. It's lovely to catch up when we're together. And I miss her, I will miss her, and keep missing her. It's a great place for dinner dates and gang hangs. The cabanas by the water are great to chill at. The best time to visit Ia is for a sundowner. Cupid's magic lingers in the air, where the ambience is as charming as the love that surrounds you. Cheers to the moments that sparkle and cocktails that shimmer. At Ia, every clink is a celebration of joy and elegance. Embrace the spirit of love at Ia. Indulge in a culinary journey that speaks the language of love. We passed by the Turkish ice cream corner, waited for the cab and reached home for some refreshments. note including these just for the ASMR and we sat down to watch the official wedding video I'll show you guys some of the highlights what I love the most is how the bride was smiling throughout the rituals even after a whole day of fasting sleepless nights and tiring ceremonies 
get left with full of laughter. She definitely landed up in the right hands. Last minute gathering with friends and close ones. And it's finally time for Vidai to officially bid farewell to the bride before she heads to her new home. Still with a happy, happy smile on her face. Wishing the lovely couple a happy married life. And she filled me in on few of the ceremonies that I had missed out, the details and what was being said in Assamese. She translated them to me, the good times she had and fun memories. There are a lot of interesting rituals that are very exciting like the most famous ring fishing and there was another one here that they were following which is to do with coins. So the bride holds on to a few coins and the groom should struggle to get them out. Basically which indicates how good the bride is to save up money. Well, that was indeed a good fight. After all this discussion, our foot arrived and we are sitting on Netflix searching for the best thing to watch. And yes, after watching a lot of trailers, we picked friends for the night and had a nice sleep with tummy full and happy. To wake up in the morning to my favorites, usually love to have multigrain bread with peanut butter and my most favorite, these garlic and herbs buttery spread by Amul love to have for breakfast with bread. One might think healthiest but it is also the quickest, simplest and tastiest breakfast you can have early in the morning. And that's a wrap guys. Back on the move. See you next time.